Welcome, welcome. We're gonna get the bell ringing because it's the weekend. It's the weekend, so let's see what's happening for you guys. Um, sorry that I can't do on live. <laughs> My eyes, <laughs> I haven't slept because I have been getting you guys the uh, monthlies out. It was a busy month. It was a horrible month. <laughs> So I am so glad. Welcome to December. Happy birthdays to everyone who is having birthdays on the 1st of December. You are an obsolete person. So let's go in. First, I'm going to do the birthdays. Then I'm going to do all signs starting um, starting with um, all um, the signs, um, the air signs, and then we work down. Okay. I'm sorry, guys. My <laughs> I haven't slept for 24 hours. So let's go. Let's see what's happening. Something pop out. The Two of Cups in reverse for you birthday peeps. I don't know what's happening, but I hope it's good. Okay, so let's look and see what's happening for the birthday peeps. Okay, it's your birthday. It's your birthday. Let's see what's happening for the birthday peeps. Oh my god, I really need to sleep. <laughs> I really need to sleep. Okay, let's see what's happening for the birthday peeps. We have the two of the tree of swords, heartbreak. We have lies and deception. We have the wheel of fortune. We have the two of wands. And we have the lovers. So, but we have nine of cups so this is good for you birthday people so for the people who are having birthdays um your year is going to start really good um you have the energy of the nine of cups coming out and this is going to be a very good year especially when it comes on to love okay so this is good because um, whatever the deception, whatever the heartbreak in the past, there is going to be new beginnings, new situations, and it's going to be fabulous. Okay, so let's see what else is coming out. We are going to be looking at the heartbreaks. So, so let's see what's happening for you, birthday peeps. We're going to see, we see some regrets, love regrets that is going to be coming up in this year for you guys whatever that is all about let's look and see what's happening for you birthday peeps okay with the heartbreak we have the page of wands okay with the lies and deception we have um the um the knight of wands which is a older person okay with the wheel of fortune we're going to be seeing what's happening with the wheel of fortune we have um, um, the Nine of Swords, some worries. Um, the Wheel of Fortune comes with some worries. And a new start is coming in for. So the outcomes and what's happening with the lovers. So what's happening with the lovers? What is happening with the lovers? And it's all for you men. Men. It's all for you men in this year. You start the year off with some um, stuff. The women have the energy of the pay, the nine of cups, which is in dreams coming true. So for you birthday people who are having birthdays today, that's wonderful. But the lovers, some of you are going to be connecting with the king of cups. So, oh my God. <laughs> Oh my God, look at this. Twice your wishes and dreams are coming true. Damn. Happy birthdays to you people. Happy birthday, happy birthday. Um, This is good. This is positive. So for the people who are having birthdays today, it's positive. 
you have the nine of cups your wishes and dreams are going to be coming through in this year so has from tomorrow look out because things is about to line up for you guys you have twice the energy of the nine of cups wishes and dreams coming through oh my god this is so good you guys okay so let's go and take a deeper look at your reading some of you men between the ages of 15 and 45 you had some heartbreaks in the past you're coming in with this heartbreak whatever the situation was whatever that was transpiring um, you guys have heartbreaks in the past okay so the men between the ages are it, could, it doesn't have to be women or men because um, this is a Spanish deck that I'm just trying out and and they don't have the female counterpart so it could um, this energy could be for men and women so the people between the ages of um, 15 and 45 I'm seeing some heartbreaks that is coming up from out the past but it's going to be okay all right it's gonna be okay so some of you um, are going to meet uh, someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion coming in what is happening is the wheel of fortune with the nine of the swords so whatever the situation is um, this situation is, needs to end I'm gonna turn off my dryer because I'm, I'm outside and I'm gonna do my coffee I'm so sorry <laughs> so I gotta drink a lot of coffee because I've been up all night getting your monthly's out so um, there is a past situation this past situation affects the men 45 years and older there was some deception it could be you yourself or it could be something that has transpired against you um, so um, uh, you men 45 years and older it could be you or it could be something that is transpiring but it's going to be coming up in this year for you guys the outcomes is an offer and new start the outcomes is going to be an offer and new start this is going to be good this is going to be fabulous for some of you you're going to be connecting um, with a um, some of you you're going to be connecting with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion this is good this is positive um, this is going to be a really positive relationship whatever the situation is this is just going to be so positive whoever this person is they're coming in they do love you they do love you do they do care about you whatever you want um, if it was that some of you have met someone who's a Pisces cancer or a scorpion and um, you know it was often it was going you know often to often to often to not to worry um, this person is going to make a decision and he's going to be offering you love so love is going to be coming in for some of you in this year and a new offer from the Pisces cancer or our scorpion okay this is an older person um, for some of you this could be um, your marriage or relationship that is going to be starting a new maybe this person comes in and said hey um, you know I really care about you and miss you I want to do this with you what do you think let's do this okay it could be someone new that is coming in um, but this person so your year is focused on love um, love is the center of your year your year is focused on love love is the center of your year and because this is a birthday reading it's going to affect a lot of people especially people who are married uh, people who are in soulmate relationships whatever is happening whatever is transpiring but not to worry your wishes and dreams are going to be coming out so I guess you men and women um, kudos to you guys because this year 2018 um, you're just starting 2018 because you just finished 2017 so um, the nine of cups your wishes and dreams are coming true wonderful positive energy vibration so kudos to you guys I am wishing you guys a very wonderful wonderful birthday um, 
and to the people some of you could have been in a relationship or a marriage with this person whoever this person is um, it, this person could be coming back in your life or it could be um, this person um, really cares about you and want to be in a relationship with you go for it okay wonderful I'm gonna move on and look at the air signs but I'm gonna go get my coffee because I haven't slept so I gotta have my coffee I have moved I have been live, so um, um, we are going to be still doing the weekend readings. Okay, so we're calling up the angels and guides for the Aquarius and Moon Horizon sign to show us what is coming in for this weekend. This weekend is the um, um, 48th week of the month. I miss you guys. I miss the live. I miss the chats. I miss you guys, but. I gotta find out a best way to do the readings for the lives for you guys so let's see what's happening um for the Aquarian your whole um, this sign is the energy of you finding in a strength and balance in this weekend whatever is happening find in a strength and balance with the energy of the lovers so obviously there are situations that is having happening with love relationships um, there is some heartbreaks with a love relationship um, it is a karmatic situation and the outcomes is um, the eye princess now there is the five of cups I'm seeing the five of cups coming up in this weekend is the second time I'm seeing it so for you Aquarians what I'm seeing is that you need to find in a strand with a relationship um, um, the high princess is here there's going to be some heartbreaks um, some of you are going to be having some regrets with a relationship or with someone um, you have connected with I am seeing the wheel of fortune that is here but it's in the past coming in the future we have the lovers and heartbreak so some of you have to balance out situations at home the eye princess is here for you guys in this weekend it is some energy of the Pisces but it could be secrets coming up so let's see what is happening with the energy of balance you have the king of cups so with the lovers you have um, the six of one some news is coming in um, the art breaks there's going to be a new start so this is good um, and the page of cups is coming in to offer you love and a new start and offer is coming up okay um, so um, some of you have a regrets over money it could be but first we are going to be looking at what is happening now coming in this weekend some of you um, could have been dealing with the Pisces cancer or a scorpion man um, whoever this person is whoever um, this person however he comes up in your life it could be your father um, it could be a boss it could be an, an uncle or a family member however he comes up um, this is going to be resolved okay it's a karmatic situation it is going to be resolved now we have the energy of the wheel of um, the wheel of fortune and um, the page of cups so some of you your kids could be you know I'm showing appreciation or people could show in appreciation and um, you know saying thank you and really showing you love whatever the, the situation is whatever the energy whatever that is coming through okay so this is really wonderful really positive some of you are going to be receiving some real nice feedback okay and this is um, this is basically the outcomes when we look at the lover in the future going into the next week we have some good news coming in so some of you could be receiving positive news um, about love or from someone um, someone that you had some regrets about so it could be a conflict it could be 
like um, you had some quarrel or misunderstanding miscommunication with someone it brings some regret but some good news is about to come in now for the people who was heartbroken or have lost something a new start is coming in for you and this new start is going to be very wonderful and very positive now the center of your reading you have the energy of the eye princess and she's offering you something something that is going to be really stab uh, stable in your life so this is going to be wonderful and going to be positive because whatever she's offering it's going to be coming in as an healing for some of you okay so it could comes in as a healing or there is a secret or something that is going to be coming out where she is going to be letting you know um, something that you weren't aware of okay so you had a heart broke uh, um, heartbreak about something it could be about money um, because I'm seeing the page of Pentacles here but the page of Pentacles is actually bringing you money um, it's coming in bringing you money okay so the I princess could be letting you um, be aware that um, someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion um, that you're dealing with that is from a karmatic situation they do love you um, it's not a question it is um, letting you know that they really really do love you um, they care about you a lot whoever this person is they really care about you a lot they want to help you um, they want to let you know how they feel about you but they're not really sure some of you who have kids that um, connect with your kids in this weekend because obviously as kids um, you know spend some time with your kids in this weekend because it is showing up here um, the eye princess is going to um, let you in on a secret about a Pisces cancer or scorpion man 45 years and older and this person could be asking you um, for a new start maybe you have thought that this person didn't want to be with you and they're going to let you know hey I really care about you um, I've always been thinking about you and you know I'm not letting you go whatever it is I want to be with you okay so hmm, let's move on to the um the we're moving on to um the um the bill <laughs> but I think it's so cute uh, there is a shop that I go still and um she said oh my god I got a bell it's good to have a bell um so okay let's look at the Gemini's what's happening for the Gemini Sun Moon and Rising sign what is happening for the Gemini Sun Moon and Rising sign let's see what's coming up for the weekend for the Gemini Sun Moon and Rising sign Gemini Sun Moon and Rising sign we have the energy of the magician which is yourself coming in um, with um, the six eight of cups leaving a negative situation behind making a decision and what is going to be your outcomes is the queen of swords okay so all right you ladies 45 years and older there is yes, you are the central for this weekend so um this weekend is going to affect the latest 45 years and older now I'm saying that you um, have um, a way of dealing with your enemies because they're in the reverse okay um, I'm saying that you have made a decision about leaving a situations behind okay you have came up with the best idea of how to resolve a situation um, because you're deciding to leave a negative situation with your enemies behind okay your enemies is in the reverse it's as if you decide um, no um, I think I know what to do because the hermit comes in and he's shedding a light on a situation to you the hermit comes in he's shedding the light on the situation to you you're going to make the decision to make a move okay so this could be affecting everyone but I'm seeing um, you latest 45 years and older is in the center of the reader and this weekend let's see what else is coming out for you guys the magician um, the knight of Pentacles the six of one the knight of Pentacles is going to be coming in 
and helping you guys I'm seeing the Knight of Wands the energy of um, working with you I'm seeing you and your enemies and the five of Pentacles I'm seeing the energy of the sword coming up so um, there we are um, we have the energy of the six of cups a family situation okay so your outcomes is the seven of swords the seven of swords comes out um, so there is some deception um, so obviously some of you are going to be finding out about some deception it doesn't really matter what age you are you're going to be finding about uh, finding out about some deception okay so let me see what the deception is all about I don't have my other little deck I love working with the, that other little deck it always um, shows so many things so what is the deception about oh you're seeing the truth of a situation okay so this situation could be happening at um at work for some of you okay so the energy of the magician is your own self that means you come up with something brilliant brilliant and the night um this person is a taurus virgo or capricorn between the ages of 25 and 45 is going to be coming in and helping you out with a situation because you it's as if you come up with a brilliant idea and he's going to be coming up and helping you with the situation so um this is good the knight is a taurus virgo or capricorn for some of you um you're deciding to leave a situation behind it has to do with the knight of ones the knight of ones is uh, an Aries Leo or Sagittarius man 45 years and older you were working together with him and you decide no this is not the person um, um, there's a lot of deception with this person and um, you decide to just walk away from this person and please I love you Gemini's but I gotta find out what is this deception about I know, I know, I know, I know. I wasn't prepared. I have not any sleep. Okay, let's see what this deception is all about. Because obviously, some of you Gemini's are going to find out in the weekend about some deception. Um, it could be coming from an older man that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius. What is the deception for the Gemini's in this weekend? Okay, it, it has to do with. Um, you have used your power in the wrong way and you're understanding now and you're kind of reversing that and realizing hey um, this person was being deceptive I've used my power in a way because of this person told me something um, and it's not true and you know I want to release myself from this situation okay so um, someone in power abuse um, their power it could be you or it could be someone else okay so let's look at this um, some of you your enemies are now in the reverse form and this is good um, what is happening is that with your enemies in a reverse form you're coming out of a cold situation um, information is going to be coming at you um, this is definitely information going to be coming at you and letting you know something that has happened and has transpired okay information is going to be coming at you now you're going to be making a, um, some of you are going to be making a decision about a family situation in this weekend it could have to do with something with Christmas but you have the eight of ones you are protected okay so some of you have to make a decision about a family situation it could have to do with Christmas but you're protected okay I'm getting about Christmas so but you are protected okay so we're moving on to the Librans. We are moving on um, to the Librans. I gotta get these cards out because I'm trying out the Spanish decks. I like to try out a lot of cards to see what is happening. So um, let's shuffle your cards because I'm really, really. 
like sh shuffle your cards and see what is happening for the Librans. So I can't. I will just go back and listen to the video to find out where it is because I can't stop. I just want. I'm just want to make your weekend video. Okay, so we want to look at the Librans and see what is coming up in the weekend for the Librans and Moon and Rising Sun. I love you guys so much. You just speak the truth. You just bring the sword in. Okay. Some of you are dealing with someone who's an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius. He fell out in the reverse. Okay. It could be that some of you are trying to move on, and every time it's one foot further and two foot backwards. But an offer is going to be coming in from this person, which um, is good. Um, it doesn't have to be from this person. They're saying it could be from the Knight of Pentacles. Whoever this Knight of Pentacles is, is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. A message that was supposed to come in as in the reverse, and yet still there is going to be a celebration. Okay. A lot of people in this weekend is getting the nine of cups so a lot of good things are happening to you liberals in this weekend okay whatever the situation is a lot of you liberals so what I'm looking at is that some of you are trying to go forward but you're looking backwards okay you're not moving forward some of you wants to move forward but there's things that is happening I offer it's going to be coming in from a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn this person is over the age of 45 now um it, this offer could be um um there is going to be celebration in this um weekend for some of you um liberals there is going to be some celebration um if someone if you um or someone was um investigating you or so that is over now that is over now if you were doing it or someone was doing it it's over now What's happening with this night? Um, the night here is the seven of pentacles and the four of swords. I think this person um, or whoever you are, um, you're working on a project and it's as if you're tired. You're so tired. Um, you could be. Um, it's as if you're saying yeah uh, I'm doing so much but you know is what is it for keep on doing it keep on doing it the energy of the nine of cups your wishes and dreams are going to be coming true what's happening for the two of ones for you and the two of ones offer is coming in there is some um, worries about this offer you're seeing the truth about this offer so night um, of okay so um, this is um, wonderful um, sorry this card shouldn't be in yeah it's the ace of Pentacles <laughs> so some of you could be receiving message from a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and he's uh, he's um, um, he's bringing you money money is coming to you okay let me see what this page what the information but you're you know whatever the information that is coming in there was an offer there was some worries you're seeing the truth of this offer and it's as if um it's in the reverse but no matter what is happening you're going to be celebrating why is it in the reverse why are you in the reverse because of the okay all right um look this is always an offer whatever the offer is about there was some worries about this offer and you saw the truth of what transpire okay so some of you could have gotten that offer and you're thinking hmm now there's something not right so listen to your intuition because you're correct you receive an offer but you knew that something wasn't quite right okay it's as if someone called you um, last week or in the week or Friday and said hey I'm offering you something and you're thinking mm, I don't know something is kind of off it's like you got mixed signal it's like they said something and then you're thinking back and you think hey something isn't correct for some of you, um, this man could be your husband. I'm seeing some of you going out with this person. He's a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn man. 
um, is an elderly man he's 45 years and older this could be your father um, um, and you need to make a decision um, about this person this person could be offering you um, financial um, stone help because he's going to be helping you out financially whoever this person is he's going to be helping you out financially okay now this is over really opposite the offer that came in so some of you the offer that came in some of you were like hmm I don't know what's happening something is a little bit off um, and then you're not going to be hearing anything okay this this is coming out at the outcomes opposite when the offer was and it has to do with the king of swords but <laughs> this king of swords really care about you whoever this king of swords is is as if um, it's someone you um, it could be you you men um, 45 years and older um, you're gonna be connecting you could be connecting or offering something to someone and the other person is thinking mm, that do you really mean this or whatever is happening okay so it's just in the weekend um, it could happen for you guys in the week okay um, we have the energy of celebration and we're going to be seeing what are we gonna celebrate what are we gonna celebrate because I'm seeing love oh my god I don't know the nine of cups is coming up celebration your wishes and dreams are coming true baby okay I love you Libran so much honestly honestly I get a, you know I get I really get along with all the signs I don't have like a sign that I would say no okay so um what's happening okay all right so wonderful 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 there's gonna be celebration and some of you are going to be receiving your wishes and dream coming out in the weekend so this is good you love friends have a wonderful weekend weekend remember some of you um, someone who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn is going to be helping you out financially okay he's gonna be helping you out financially okay so let's see what else is happening um, some of you men could be offering someone out their love it could be your kids but I'm feeling it's more of uh, you know um, you know really letting someone know how they feel about how you feel about them okay so we're moving on to the fire sign oh earth sign <laughs> I told you I didn't sleep you got a sip of coffee so we're moving on to the heart sign remember guys this is just for the weekend this weekend all right I should have done it on Friday even but I had the week the month list that was something else because I want to show you guys the layout of the cards but it takes so long um, to bounce it really takes long to bounce so um, for some of the month list you guys are not going to be seeing the cards because I prefer to get them out on the first okay let's see what's happening for the Taurus and moon horizon in this weekend my beeps the Tauruses what's happening for the Tauruses we have the men between the ages of 15 and 45 coming in damn a lot of people are going to be receiving money in this weekend pages are coming in and they're bringing in money okay it's not as if okay so um you know the five of cups is coming up so it's it's, it's a weekend where there are some regrets okay there this is a weekend where there are some regrets okay you men have to make a decision and the decision is um you have to make a decision over something because um the energy of the magician is here so you men really really have to make a decision um, a decision about moving away turning your back it's as if you men um, or moving forward um, to something else um, it could be that 
a payout was supposed to come you were supposed to receive some money and um, that's not going to happen so you're having some regret so let's see what's happening to um, you peeps I told you the money came the money came nine of Pentacles what is happening here seeing the truth of the situation the page of the Pentacles and you have the energy of the seven three of cups celebration okay three 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 whatever is happening in this weekend for you Tauruses um, obviously you have the outcomes of three 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 okay so let's see um, what is transpiring what is this decision that they need to make because some of you have to make a decision some of you have to make a decision about um, um, okay that so you know you Tauruses are all here um, especially you men by this card over especially you men so I'm having the energy of the five of cups some regrets and a decision to move forward and here you can see that this night have some regrets and decision to move forward we have um, the three 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 okay whatever the situation is in this um, it's gonna affect the everyone because um, there is these people 15 to 45 and also 45 and older so let's see what is coming in we see um, the kids oh yeah the night oh there is some real nasty thing that is happening here okay some news is going to be coming um, from um, to you ladies you Tauruses some news is going to be coming in um, to you Tauruses whatever is happening but you um, Tauruses uh, between the ages of uh, 15 and 15 and uh, 45 there is a situation with some money and some jealousy and hate um be aware of this okay so it's as if you receive some money or you have to pay out some money it could be some of you receiving the money or some of you here that you have to pay out the money okay um the kids um, money is going to be coming in because it's it's pointing towards in words so money is going to be coming in you're going to see the truth of the situation stability is going to be coming long-term financial stability is going to be coming in okay for you Tauruses so it's as if you see it little by little drop by drop and the page is coming in because it's is facing the reading and it's saying that yes you're seeing that long-term financial stability is going to be coming in okay now the energy of the magician is here it could be that um, you ladies are working with magic or what um, the seven of one um, they're saying you're on the right part um, it could be someone um, you are the person who is doing it or it could be a healing or something that you're doing and they're saying yes you're on the right part stand your ground about something you're on the right part okay outcomes three 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 it has to do with growth there are celebrations some of you are going to decide to leave something behind there's going to be some celebration this is all about um the a uh, past life situation you could be overcoming a situation you could be understanding a situation there is some jealousy here so be careful now what we see is that for the men 45 years and older you have to make a decision okay and news is coming in for you men 45 years and older uh, it's, it, it's not really men for you people 45 years and older you have to make a decision whatever the situation is you really have to make a decision and news is coming in there is going to be coming an end to a situation eight of cups is here so, so there was some regrets uh, there are going to be some regrets because it's coming up in the weekend and some of you are going to decide to walk away from a situation okay so let's move on to the Virgos what's happening to the Virgos in this weekend what is happening to the Virgos in this weekend? I'm using three different decks, so I have to like pull them out of each other. The Virgos, see? 
for not sleeping for 24 hours and why on track okay Virgo Sun Moon and Rising Sun let's see what's happening for the Virgo Sun Moon and Rising Sun Virgo Sun Moon and Rising Sun what's happening what's happening for the Virgos in this weekend you have a card popping out already you have the King of Cups um, but he's given us love somewhere else because it's facing outwards. <laughs> what else do you have? Oh no, <laughs> he was like, Oh god, okay, all righty, okay. Um, what's coming out for the Virgos? What's coming out for the Virgos? Virgos, Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign. What's the outcome? Okay, the Six of Cups, okay. So, you Virgos, um, some of you could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion. Um, he could be letting you know how he feels about you. A possibility does exist. I'm seeing a lot of people coming up here. Whatever the situation is, whatever the energy is, I'm seeing a lot of people that is coming up here. I am seeing the Six of Swords, whatever the energy of the Six of Swords is happening. I'm seeing this also coming up. The Knight of Wands is here and the King of Wands. I'm seeing a family situation. I'm seeing some of you have to deal with maybe these uh, a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion, of an Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius. Um, it's you older men. I'm seeing someone who, um, you know, whoever this person is, is bringing love to the family. There's coming an end to a situation, so let's look. Who is the Spices? Why is he here? Um, there's a situation. Um, the Spices, why is he here? What is um, his situation? Um, the Pisces is saying something. He wants to inform you. Love, he wants to turn his back. Um, it's all about money for the king of wands you are protected I'm seeing you leaving a situation behind but you're protected I'm seeing some of you having some regrets um, some of you having some regrets with a new love you men uh, or you people 45 years and older you want to turn your back on the love okay what's this with a family okay six 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 to six new start okay some of you men 45 years uh, women and men 45 years older what we're seeing here is that there is going to be a new start okay there is going to be a new start um the king of cups is coming in with a message king of cup is coming in with a message what is this all about um it's about a new start okay the king of cups some of you who are connected with someone um, 45 years and older, he wants a new start. He wants to talk to you. He wants a new start. Okay. He has kids and he wants to know how you feel about that. He wants a new start. Okay. I'm seeing new love coming in, but the Six of Swords is here. It's as if you want to end it. What's happening? This new love that is coming in is um, it's going to be ended. Okay, so if some of you had started seeing someone and that sort of a thing, um, because it's the Ace of Cups, it's going to be ended. Um, King of Wands uh, trying to put a block on your financial uh, st stability, but luck is going to be coming out. What else is the outcomes for these guys? There's a secret that is about to happen okay so for the people who are dealing with the king of cups he wants to um you know let you know that he wants a new start with you so if um whoever you are um um your virgo um woman or man because could be a same-sex relationship he wants a new start with you the message is coming in um, and and some of you it could be your child's father that is coming in um, to um, conversate with you now some of you were dealing with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn um, over the age of 45 there was um, you know connection a relationship um, but it's going to be ended okay uh, it's not going anywhere so you're going to be deciding to end it now whoever this Aries Leo Sagittarius man is 
it's all about money he's hiding some money or he wants to block your money so be aware of it whoever he is he's hiding some money or he wants to block your money be careful of this man deception man um, the six comes in which um, the six of swords you're walking away turning your back on this person you're spiritually protected you have some luck that is coming out you Virgos okay there is some luck and the luck is coming from uh, a secret is going to be coming out it could be a secret about a Taurus um, an Aries Leo or Sagittarius um, person um, and that secret is going to be coming out it could be someone who's connected with the family um, 66 um, material over your material wealth and word uh, go by the lottery this weekend 66 this is twice 66 you have a double okay so go by the lottery there's some information that is going to come out about your materialistic state some of um, you men are going to be having a new start whatever the situation is luck is here for you guys so um, there's a little luck that is coming in for the people who decide to walk away or leave a situation behind there is some luck that is coming in nice reading you Virgos yeah luck um, luck is coming in so that is good six to six six of cups six of Pentacles help is going to be coming in for some of you okay so um, be aware of that the ace of cups whatever the situation is um, we are seeing that things are going to be happening for you Virgos. okay oh mm. not a bad weekend let's move on to the Capricorns Capricorns Ooh, Cappies, you're showing me your hands okay Capricorn Sun Moon and Rising this weekend reading what's happening for the Capricorns what's happening for the Capricorns and ooh, okay there's some lies and deception that is coming from the week okay what else is coming out but you have a strong foundation okay um, you have the four of cups some regrets four 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 there is some double but good news is coming in and you need to just balance out a situation okay strange things I'm seeing um, a reverse it could be with a working connection with someone or in a relationship maybe um, you're waiting to hear from someone because the Knight of Wands is here you're waiting to hear from someone for some of you um, it could be a love relationship a partner or something or a friend but you haven't heard anything okay um, the two of cups is in reverse okay what we're seeing is some lies and deception and you're regretting something some lies and deception and you're regretting something anyway you have a strong foundation and you're going to be receiving some good news okay so there has been some lies and deception because it's that is um, the five of swords or the nine of swords five of swords or the nine of swords so let's see what is happening to these is it worries um, about the knight of wands um, the knight of wands is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius okay we have here the eight of wands you could be working with this person but you have a strong foundation then um, we have the eight of cups um, there could be you know as if yeah I don't know but there's an offer that is coming in and this is this offer is going to be good there's some good news about a new offer that is coming in okay so energy of the five of Pentacles um, is here upwards so we're going to be um, looking at that but let's see um, what should you find balance with what is it that you should find balance with what is it that you should find balance with a new start okay so I am seeing this clearly mm, okay what lies in deception in this person who is this person okay an invitation is coming from an um, Aries Leo or Sagittarius person I'm seeing you deciding to make a decision about work decision 
um, I'm seeing some clouds here and I'm seeing a friend bringing you some messages and the outcomes as there are some talking you guys also have luck just like um, the Virgos but your luck is on the side it's as if um, going into next week some luck is going to be coming in um, with something that you had some regrets and you decide to leave behind some luck is going to be coming in okay so let's look at this this is the eight of swords something you're not seeing clearly eight of swords something you're not seeing clearly with the energy of and Aries Leo or Sagittarius with an invitation okay so some of you could have gotten an invitation from this person but you're not seeing what is behind this invitation why they wanted to work with you why they want to collaborate um, with you because most of the time people only think about their own um, yeah most of the time people only think about their own uh, whatever so you know it's be careful but um, you're not seeing why this person wanted to collaborate with you he's gonna be inviting you someplace um, it could be someone who you have met lately and he's gonna um, I think he might be younger than you are and he's gonna be um, inviting you out I don't know I'm feeling don't go I'm feeling don't get caught up with this person okay we have the energy of the four of ones whatever is it you have a strong foundation you can say you know um, at home this is really the energy about home and um, or work okay because work comes up so obviously um, some of it is home or work some of you are going to decide to move away or some of you are um, wondering about work situation um, coming up in this week okay so some of you might decide um, you know I want to you know this work situation is it gonna work out is it something for me that sort of a thing so you're thinking about this work situation because a change of work is coming in um, you could be receiving a message that is not going to go forward that could be it also um, but it has something to do with work and a change that is coming in or you need to make the change that is coming in you have some regrets some regrets is coming up and you're going to just let it go um, there is the cloud and you're just gonna let it go so some regrets are coming up and it has to do with a house situation or a work situation you could be receiving some message that um, you know it didn't work out the way you wanted it or um, there was a situation or something you know whatever the situation is um, um, this there was some there there was there were some deceptive things that was going on okay now some good news is coming in an offer someone could be inviting you out a friend could be inviting you out this is what I see coming in that some of you could be invited out um, in this weekend okay so uh, and I am feeling and this is what I'm feeling you know it's as if you have met someone and then this person invites you out and I'm having the feelings don't go I'm having the feelings um, there is more to this invitation okay there is more to this invitation um, let me there's some luck some message about money is going to be coming in who is this person and because I'm just receiving a feelings it's as if some of you um, have met this person and there is there is a reason behind it but you're not seeing we want to know what is it it's as if you met this person last week and then they're going to be calling you and asking you out and I'm feeling don't go I'm feeling don't go now uh, it's about money and the star uh, uh, there we go it's about money power financial uh, but this is good um, the person has money 
um, the person sits good in life um, yeah it's someone who is well off very rich so some of you met someone like a week or some time ago he is and um, an Aries Leo or Sagittarius uh, he's he's gonna want to invite you out at home I don't know this is a this is someone who's really rich really wealthy well off rich wealthy well off mm, I don't know I'm feeling as if there's something but um if it was me I would say no I I, I got so much to do but it's actually because you're not seeing a situation but this person is really wealthy he's um he has money he has business he's uh, it's someone who you, you have crossed parts with okay it's someone you have crossed parts with and he's um he he wants to be a friend he wants to be a friend I, but you have met a person like last week or because it's in the past okay so you have met someone in the past he is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius um yeah yeah he's gonna be inviting you to his home because I'm seeing the energy of the house so it's his home and He's financial stable and he could have worked with the government. Okay. I don't know. I don't even like taking the taxi alone. So I can't tell you guys whether or not you should go. All right. What I'm seeing here is a work situation where a decision is going to be coming in. You have to make a decision. Um, I'm seeing some regrets, but some luck is coming in. I'm seeing news about money that is coming into you. I see new news about money that is coming into you. I see some balance with a new start, and I'm seeing a lot of people talking, a lot of gossip. Okay, it's not it's it's not really positive gossip. It's just, just people being just bloody brutal, and just like to speak. Okay. Let me see what this gossip is about. Some of it could be positive because it's about money, but it's as if you're receiving some money and people know about it and they, they're they like jealous. You know, the green eye monster. What is this all about? I told you. It's, um, it has to do with um, a woman and um, some news is coming to you, okay? I told you, green eye monster. All right, you Capricorns. So I'm wishing you a wonderful weekend. And for the people who have met this person, now if he's a Sagittarius, go go out. But a Aries, don't 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 bother with it. But because you're Capricorns, if this person is a Sagittarius, then you can go out with him. If it's a Leo or so, don't do it. You're just asking for trouble in your life, you Capricorns. Just don't do it, okay? So, if it's a Sagittarius because he's close to your sign, do it, okay? We're off to the Aries. Okay, let's see what's coming up for the Aries Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. Okay, Aries, you got a card here. Ooh, Aries, yes. Ah, uh, you need to see clarity in this weekend about something, you Aries. What's happening for you, Aries? Clarity about an offer that is coming in. Um, there's some message that is coming in. This is someone who cares about you, but there is lies and deception, lies and deception, lies and deception. This person could be spying on you. This person could be wanting to know about your financial stability this person wants to know who is in your life um, the situation is all about lies and deception it's as if um, um, some of you are going to be hearing something or someone and whoever you're connecting with is just some lies and deception um, you're not seeing uh, you're not seeing something clear about an offer that you have received okay 
if some of you it could have to do with your your partner you could realize or find out that your husband or wife is lying to you okay what are the areas not seen clearly I love you guys so much you're gonna you're gonna be victorious over it though whatever it is you're gonna be victorious about it okay offer of money is coming in I also see the seven of cups um, there is some positive energies that is coming out with the seven of cups your wishes and dreams are going to be coming true so the lies and deception there some of you Aries um, was dealing with some lies and deception you could be um, very deceptive to your own um, self the nine of cups is here it's something you are open for and wishing so you're going to be um, something you have opened wish for is going to be happening um, yeah let's see what else is coming out some of you are going to be having a new start um, some of you are going to be having a new start okay alrighty some of you weren't seeing a situation clearly yes because this is the five and I don't have my glasses say this is um, a five and three is eight so there were situations that weren't um, clear and you're seeing or you're speaking up and you're bringing this to an end you're seeing or you're speaking up and you're going to bring this to an end there could be a situation that has transpired about some money in the past week um, whatever as a transpire um, you need to pay back some money or someone needs to pay you okay because here is and normally the two of ones is an, an offer a door is open okay and it's like you have to pay back someone you it's as if you realize that you have to pay back someone this could be a family or relatives because um, there was um, some you had some conflicts with someone and you have to pay back someone okay you really have to pay back someone so whatever that is transpiring you have to pay back someone because I'm seeing and this is how the Pentacles is pointing to this lady you have to pay back the lady okay alrighty um there is some message or um, there is a message that is coming in and you're going to be standing your ground about this message some secrets are going to be coming out or you could be um, telling the secrets okay you could be telling the secrets now for some of you in your relationship whether it's your husband or partner there is going to be a new start some of you could find out that you are pregnant in this weekend or some of you could be having baby in this weekend it could be Sunday evening to Monday morning um, some of you there is information about uh, um, a child I, um, or that you could be um, having a new grandchild um, you could be finding out that your daughter-in-law or your son or um, you know you're you're going to be finding out something about a new baby <coughs> okay I hope that's not me my son doesn't want kids I do understand so middle lies it could be you or we're speaking things that wasn't true whatever it is um, some of your wishes and dreams about an invitation is going to be coming out so some of you um, wish for an invitation um, from somewhere something a new invitation or something you are wishing for is going to be coming out okay so this is good for you Aries the hermit is here to look within look at a situation whatever is happening the hermit is here saying to look um, within about a, a regrets the four of cups and something that was uh, not both of water okay it was a cunning um situation it was something very cunning all righty so some of you are going to be um, um you know if you are wishing for um to go someplace you are open that you will be invited someplace now it's going to be happening 
uh, some of you are going to be having a new start or if there was um, you know uh, a situation where you and your partner wasn't uh, um, seeing eye to eye the last time now this is going to be tearing up you Aries have a wonderful weekend okay let's look at the layers Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rise, and Sign. Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rise, and Sign. What's happening? Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rise, and Sign. Let's see what's happening for <coughs> the Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rise, and Sign. What's happening? Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rise, and Sign. What's happening? You have a strong foundation. You, Leo's, whatever is happening. Um, you have the Eight of Wands. Um, some news is going to be coming in and you know this four of cups especially in this deck is about planning so you Leah's money is the central and you have the nine of Pentacles so um, you Leah's could be receiving some money or hearing about some money now if you Leah's um, was looking for a house you could have heard about the house in the week and it's good news a strong uh, or it could be work we're going to be looking at whether it's going to affect you with the house um, you could be um, receiving an invitation we see here the seven of Pentacles it could be a lot of information is going to be coming in about your work this is going to bring you a lot of money some good news is going to be coming in if you have your own business if you're running your own business you lay us some really really positive um, news is going to be coming in a lot of fast space especially if you have your business and that sort of a thing a lot of fast space what is this four of ones all about it's all about um, financial stability it's as if you feel as if you're out in the cold but you're not really out in the cold what is this eight of ones um, you are um, you're going to be receiving some heartbreaking news okay four of cups um, you are worried about a situation three of uh, Pentacles um, is good a new start um, um, uh, your financial stability is going to be um, getting better because money is going to be coming in not only money but love okay so for the people who are looking for um, new stability in uh, money or love that is going to be coming in then this weekend if you wanted to connect with people this could be happening for you now I'm seeing some hardship at home or at work let's see what that is all about um, it's you know some of you are missing your kids you could be dealing with your kids um, at home the energy of the cloud um, friends you're going to be receiving um, news from a friend okay it's not that bad I've seen worse okay so some of you this weekend you could be having some problems at home with the kids that you want to get the kids some things and that sort of a thing um, it's Christmas so you want to go start doing the Christmas shopping and that sort of a thing so um, you know this is a situation that has to do with some of you may be not working and worrying about the kids for Christmas and that sort of a thing and that is coming in from um, you know out the the past week in this week okay now let's look at the situation we have some news could be text messages that is coming in or some news that because that is coming in from someone who you care about um, not very positive news um, um yeah it could be text messages or telephone conversation or that sort of a thing not very positive news so, um you're having some regrets and um you're having some regrets there is a, like a cloud that is blocking you i'm going to be seen and you have a block okay so it's a, it's it's the four of cups with the nine of swords you're worried about something um some of you i'm sorry i'm sitting on a leather chair <laughs> I have the shorts on so um, whatever the situation is because I'm seeing the block coming up with um, like as if some money was supposed to come to you but it's block and there's a lot of talking 
and but a solution is going to be coming for the situation okay so whatever the situation is a solution is going to be coming now the outcomes is going to be good because so the six of ones is upright and some of you are going to be receiving an offer or some good news about work a friend could be saying hey why don't we collaborate together and make things happen and this is going to be good okay so that's not bad because this is coming in that is the outcomes they're going to be saying why don't we collaborate together and let things work out now we have the energy of the nine of Pentacles some of you your financial stability is going to be getting better um, news of positive financial stability that is going to bring you happiness and joy so this is good this is good so um, you know um, some people always said what do you choose love or money it's up to you because there is money and your financial stability is going to be good for the people who were worried about money for their kids in the past week um, unexpected money is going to be coming in I'm seeing some regrets here and some blocks and some talking and that sort of a thing there's some like little nay nay sayers and this could be coming up some Saturday evening going into Sunday okay but it's, it's, it's just someone that just wants to be friggin annoying okay um, so you have the four of cups and some worries the clouds um, it's clearing up but then we have this block and like people are talking because they want to block you there's really some haters out there I'm just seeing this but you know the outcomes is going to be good because then people are going to want to collaborate with you and be friends with you so this is going to be good alrighty Ooh. Some of you who are working on a project, this is going to be good. So if you're working on a project, some money is going to be coming in and a resolution is going to be happening. Okay. So this is so wonderful. So wonderful. Let's move forward and see what is happening. Let's move forward and see what is happening let's move forward and see what is happening okay alrighty all right let's move on so we're moving on to the Sagittarians what's happening for the Sagittarians happy birthday happy belated for birthday and happy birthday for the Sagittarians next week after I'm finished with this I'm going to do the weekly readings. so there we go Alrighty, yes, some money um, could be with your work and end devil. Um, but you're going to be happy. Yeah, and 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 then you're saying how um, justice is going to be coming in and say no. You know, someone wanted to do something. Someone wanted to get in, get some money. Uh, you know, your work. Someone is. Uh, um, some of you be careful and it doesn't have to be your work okay some of you are going to be dealing with someone who's going to intimate in a situation because I'm seeing something about your work or your project and then the energy of the tower and the devil is here okay and you're going to be coming out of this okay so someone who is or it could be um, a legal situation or it could be like there's a conflict and someone is going to intermediate the tower is here the devil is over here and you're going to be overcoming this situation let's see what's happening with the eight of pentacles the eight of pentacles have to do with the king of cups we have the tower um with the four of swords we have the devil um with money oh 88 oh my god um, you you Sagittarians 88 go by the lottery 88 a new star 88 you have eights on the opposite side you have um, the energy of you coming out of the week with a work situation with the king of cups it could be work but it could be you're collaborating with the king of cups or working with the king of cups that sort of a thing and then you have the devil and your work someone is trying um, it's as if someone is trying to 
block you or do something that it's just a deceptive energy okay it's a really deceptive energy so we're going to look at this but you have 88 on the opposite side what we have here is a um what we have here is the my but, but, but we have the tower okay it's a man okay the devil is a, a, a man he's in the reverse okay there is a man that was trying to decept something or do something what is that name with the work and the um what is that name with the work and the key okay now the work some of you could be collaborating with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion and we have the energy here of a block a block okay a block okay all right let's see what is coming up with the tower and the four of swords we have a strong foundation we have um, not to worry about the situation now with the devil and the man there is going to be a transition and the um, the lava so celebration um, what else is coming out this is good actually um, a common little situation is at hand and you have to make a decision about it okay a cunning little situation is at hand, and you have to make a decision okay this could be a collaboration with this person and the cloud is by this person whatever the situation is the cloud is by this person so we're going to be um, you know it is as if you're not believing this person or whatever it is or there is you both may have um, um, a conversation a communication about something about work so um, anyway the tower is just going to come down because whoever was trying to do something or block because the tower is going to come down you're going to be resting and long-term stability okay you're gonna be resting you need to have some rest um, coming up so like sleep out on a Sunday morning now we have the eight against some of you there is a situation at work that you're thinking about and it has to do with this man and you're thinking about making a decision um, you need you've come to a crossroad with this man and you need to make a decision whatever and whoever he is this is um you have this energy that you're dealing with okay but this is going to come to an end so you have the block this two negative is a positive and a transition two negative is a positive and a transition okay now this is good because some of you could be invited out for dinner by someone who really likes you so some of you could be invited out for dinner um by someone who really likes you okay so someone who really likes you um is going to be inviting you out for dinner so um it could be saturday evening it could be this evening or it could be tomorrow evening okay um but it is it is coming around okay so um yeah it's 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 like it's coming it's, it's, it's can be this today or it could be tomorrow so someone could be calling you and that sort of a thing okay so Sagis and this person really care he likes you um he wants to take you out for dinner go 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 you Sagis go I don't know I was just getting the feelings for the Capricorn that was not a good idea so some of you could be saggy saggy Capricorns um go because the man has money I don't know and, you know think of how you feel about this and then you can make a decision alrighty all right we're moving on the Ophiosis mentioned let's see what's coming up for the whole yes mention that is the people who were born November 29 until December 1st please listen to your own energy vibration read and that's why I did it differently so if you were born November 29 until December 17 this is your reading and you should go and listen to the office this is after this the the Sagittarius okay so let's see what's coming up for you guys um, it's the same situation with work um, there's um, really um, you have enemies and uh, um, the devil and love is going to be coming in 
and um, some of you have some regrets justice is going to be coming up though whoever you're you know okay there is a situation where some of you at work are having some enemies um, and they're coming out okay some of you at work have some enemies and they're definitely coming out justice is there is here against them justice is here against them you have some regrets okay and it has something to do with work but there is just someone someone who is just really there annoying and it could be someone who has done something very deceptive that's why you know like they're pinning at you every time they're pinning at you every time and it's as if they want you to pay out some money okay so let's see what's happening all right we have the king of swords um coming in um uh, your enemies are going to change and start loving you we have the energy of the devil and the seven so it definitely has some of you are working on something some of you could be um, good at your work um, the energy of the five of Pentacles that you have to face out some money um, there is some regrets okay so what is coming out what is coming out um, you have here the energy of four and three four and three is seven okay four and three is seven so let's see what else is coming out okay so some of you at work you have to deal with someone who is someone who is a um, an Aries Leo or Sagittarius let's see what is happening could be your boss um, no this is your partner some of you could have a partner that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius an older person okay then we have a transition um, you, you're people who hate you are going to start to love you now whatever the situation is people who hate you are going to start to love you um, your enemies are going to start to love you now there's some news coming um, there is some news that is coming in okay what is this news all about it's a, it's a fox thing is someone uh, be, uh, trying to be very deceptive about something there is some talking and some secrets that is going to be coming out about a relationship okay this is what is coming out here about a house but happiness and joy um six of swords um, um justice is going to come in you're going to walk away you're going to be happy is the outcome but what I'm seeing is that some of you who are in a relationship or a partnership with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra um, you you know you're going to be working on this you're going to be working on your relationship your partnership with this person whether it's in love or friendship now um, I'm seeing that whatever the situation is there are some hidden enemies and they're going to start loving you there's a transition that is going to be coming in the hidden enemies enemies are going to start loving you we have the energy of the devil you have some regret there is a message that is coming in it's a cunning message from a man you know this is just really sick um, there is some situation that you have to be paying out something um, there is a situation that you have to be paying out something there is some talk there's some secrets there is some talks and some secret about love now it could be um, there's some talks and some secrets about love whatever the situation is there is some talks and some secrets about love okay so we have the energy of um, there's talking over a secret and a love affair but whatever is happening justice is going to come in and you're going to be happy about the situation justice is going to come in and you're going to be happy about the situation okay so this is good but justice is going to come in and you're going to be happy about a situation so this is good alrighty oh my god oh my god oh my god oh my god all right let's move on 
to um, the Pisces. Spicy, Pisces, what's happening for the Pisces? What's that? What's happening for the Pisces in the weekend? You're leaving something behind. You have some regret, you Pisces. You're moving on. And you're seeing the truth of the situation. You have some regrets. Okay, you're listening to your intuition. And you're moving away. You're moving on. You have some secret. There is some situation. Um, it's like you're looking back at something. You're looking back at the past and seeing something. Okay. Um, we have the three of ones. What is it with the three of ones? The three of ones comes up with a seven of ones. Stand your ground. There is some regrets. Um, and you're turning your back on that. You're moving forward um, and connecting. The hermit comes out. You are protected um, in a situation. The Four of Cups. Um, there is some information that is going to be coming at you. Um, but the Eight of Wands is as if your 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 spirit guides are giving you this um, situation. Some of you are going to be moving um, closer to your family or moving. Um, um, uh, to have more connection with your family, okay. Moving to have some connection to your family. Long term st stability um, is coming up. There's an end to a situation, so you're moving away from a situation. Some of you are going to be choosing to go back um, to connect with your family. You know, some of you are going to be choosing to go back to connect to your family, okay. Uh, love your soulmate what is coming out here okay some of you men some of you um, Pisces men are thinking to go back to your wife or something like that some of you wants to connect with your soulmate some of you wants to move to where or, or or wants to move in with your soulmate but you are you're not telling the person how you really feel but you know that this person is the love of your life i'm seeing this with you men you know that you know some of you are moving forward you want to connect with your your past life family you know that this is the person you're not going back to your ex-wife you want to move towards your soulmate or twin flame you want to move towards your soulmate and twin flame okay you want to move towards your soulmate and twin flame this is what you want you know this person from a past lifetime you know that this is a person and you want to move closer to them you want to connect with this person but it's as if some of you do not have the courage to tell this person and it's, it's affecting you men out there it's as if you men do not have the courage it's as if you men do not have the courage to say it but you're leaving a situation a long-term situation some of you were in a, a, um, a marriage for a very long time you're leaving it behind and you want to move on you want to move forward some of you is as if you have met someone and you know the day you met the person you know you knew that was the person for you because I'm seeing that you want to tell this person because this because the energy of the twin flame is here because you kind of figure out that this is your twin flame or your soul flame. you want to tell this person hey I want to be with you but you're afraid to do that um, emotionally you're afraid to do that but um, if you tell this person this person have the same feelings they want to be with you too they know they they feel it just like you feel it so um, some of your questioning but whatever you had is as if you're leaving um, your marriage or a long time partnership relationship behind um, you had some regrets and you're letting it go and you want to move forward you want to connect with your twin flame or soulmate because you want to get married or you want to move in with them or you want to tell them I want to be with you I want to spend the rest of your life but you're afraid 
but they're feeling the same way about you they're basically feeling the same way about you they want that is the same thing they want so the hermit is here and is shedding a light to say to you you know that's the same thing they want they know it they know within their heart and soul that you are the person but you you, you don't you you're not locked in to say hey I want us to become closer you drop in and it's like you're thinking why isn't this person saying anything or why isn't this person doesn't this person but the person feel the same way but it's as if you drop the ends but the person doesn't know how to pick up the ends it's as if they are thinking when is it gonna happen how long do I have to wait okay I gotta wait I gotta wait but they need to know where are they on a situation okay they need to know where are they on a situation okay so whatever the situation is whatever that is transpiring they want to know and they're feeling the same way so just tell them how you're feeling tell them you want to move closer you want to be with them you want them to be the man or woman in your life because they are feeling the same way this is so good you know you want to tell them but you're reluctant because you have here um the six you know that this person is meant for you okay um you know you have felt the connection and you know that this person was meant for you but you're reluctant to say it don't be just say it because they're feeling the same thing for you they're basically feeling the same thing for you and they're thinking why just say i i just need to know where i am how long should i wait or that sort of a thing i love you guys I love you Pisces have a good weekend think about it tell them how you're feeling ask them out for dinner or lunch they're feeling the same way okay let's look and see what is happening for the cancer Sun moon horizon sign for this weekend cancer Sun moon horizon sign Woo! money is coming in ten of Pentacles and the star Oh, you cancers, you do deserve this. Oh my God, this is like the best reading ever. Oh my God. Damn. Oh my God, you cancers, you, you guys. You have the Ten of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles and your wishes and dreams are coming out about a money situation. So your financial stability is going to be good. Then you have the energy of the star and the Ace of Pentacles. Some good news is about to come in. Wow. Some of you could be dealing with something, of, um, some discussion and whatever, but you're the star. You know, money is just going to be coming out to you and that sort of a thing. Let's see what is happening and what is transpiring. Um, your financial stability with your family is going to be good okay if you were worrying about that that is going to be good because in the week there was some worries some of you are dealing with the knight of Pentacles and the knight of Pentacles needs to pay you some money I am seeing um, the five of swords um, some conflicts your wish and dreams comes out but some conflicts but good news is coming in for you guys and you're seeing a situation about money okay so um, some of you were supposed to get some money from and um, it could be a brother or a friend or a family member um, but you're going to be receiving some good news you, see, you know that person is going to say you know I'm working on it and you're going to be receiving let's see what is happening here we have an invitation that is coming in some family is going to be friends I see the star and the knight of Pentacles so as a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn a friend is going to be helping you out and here we have um, your wishes and dream and a new start and what is the outcome so um, I'm seeing you receiving some news from some good news um, from a woman okay there is going to be some conflicts about money okay so some of you 
that was worrying about your financial situation for um, the holidays you have no need to worry because um, that is going to be okay so last week like some of you were thinking about you know how is my financial situation going to be for the holidays here you're seeing the truth about it yes so this is going to be working out in your favor okay some of you who are dealing with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn um, this person could be a friend um, this person could be a good friend um, this person was sent to you uh, the universe sent this person in your life okay so if you're dealing with the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person um, it's a good friend the universe had sent this person in your life so um, this is um, a good sign so some of you could be thinking about this person because I'm seeing you thinking about this person is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn this person and whoever this person is you're thinking about this person the universe had send them in your life now your wishes and dreams are coming true we have some conflicts here with a new start okay your wishes and dreams are coming true but you have some conflicts here with a new start now some good news is going to be coming to you about a lay day. Some good news are going to be um, could be coming to you from a, for about a lady, or it could be coming from this lady. Okay, so this lady could be um, bringing some good news to you. Okay, because um, first we had breakthroughs information and it's positive news from a lady or about a lady. So this is wonderful. Now, um, no worries about your financial situation. There could be some, um, you know, you're looking at the situation and there could be some situations. So um, whatever the energy is, is that the ten, the, the Ace of Pentacles, you're seeing a situation and a conflict about some money. Okay. Not to worry. It's going to be okay. You can serve. Um, it's going to be okay you cancers okay so whatever the situation is whatever the situation is whatever is going on whatever the situation is all right let's go ahead and look and see what is transpiring what is happening for the scorpions okay so let's see what's happening to the scorpions in this weekend let's see what's happening to the scorpions in this weekend scorpion sun moon and rising sign oh you scorpion decide to move forward justice comes in and um justice comes in for the um justice comes in for um it could be your mom there's going to be a transition um and your wishes and dreams the nine of cups your wishes and dreams okay so what happened to the situation is that i'm seeing some of you scorpion either going on a new start moving forward um there's the energy of justice um against someone or with someone this is a taurus virgo or a capricorn person you could be moving away from this person. There could be some transition. I'm seeing the five of ones, some conflicts. Okay, so let's see what is happening. Because um, um, justice and the energy of the nine of cups. So what is the situation? We have you leaving and moving away. Justice came in the four of swords. Um, the Knight of Wands and the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn, and it's all about um, financial stability and um, the Five of Swords. Okay, so some heartbreaks is here for you, Scorpions. Whatever the situation is, I am seeing some heartbreaks. Some heartbreaks is here for the Scorpion. Let's see what's happening while you're leaving, you scorpions. You're leaving a friendship or a connection, okay? Justice, there is some conflicts. There's some conflicts that is going on. There's a lot of conflicts in your head or you had some legal situation. The King of Pentacles and the King of Wands, okay? Um, 
the king of pentacles is dealing with a situation could be a mother and father if uh, your mom is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn and your father or it could be between these people it could be your mom and another man and there is some power struggle and the rest of it that is going on I'm seeing some conflicts and the four of pentacles and some sluice eyed okay and some real sluice eyed now the outcomes is a message that is coming in there's a transition a conflicts the end of a conflicts and a transition so some of you could be having the end of a conflicts and some message is coming in some of you could have the end of a conflicts and some messages coming in um, there is some heartbreaks there's lies deceitfulness we have the energy of the king of wands this could be an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian person but um, some of you are going to be having um, the nine of cups good news um, victory and success with a financial situation okay there's a lot of deceptiveness that is going on you scorpion because the energy of the snake um, it's jealousy you're jealous um, there is some jealous situation it could be you and your mom um, there is a man that is playing power over your mom and you help to do this also okay and it's all about money you did it for money there's some sluice eyed um, transition is coming up the five of swords this conflict is, is, is going to be over and a message is going to be coming in okay the stump is over and a message is going to be coming in now um, let's look and see um, what is this because there is the five of ones yeah you have some enemies around you and you have some regrets you have some enemies around you and you have some regrets okay you have some enemies around you and you have some regrets and some of you um, could have um, your father is uh, Aries Leo or Sagittarius and you're trying to you know outrage your power because this is like power play so it could be you're having a power play with your parents and you know then you're deciding to move away there is some hate and jealousy coming at your mom um, there's some heartbreak some hate and jealousy that is coming at your mom what else is coming out listen to your intuition it could be a girlfriend but um, justice comes in um, whatever the situation is I'm seeing someone if you are looking for new love if you're asking your question if new love is going to be coming in yes it's going to be coming in okay alrighty so there is a lot is going on with you scorpions um, it's, it's it's in a lick but it's it's inwards but it's also outside for you um, there I, whatever the situation that you're dealing with with an older woman that is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn you are really hating on this lady for whatever reason you have work against this lady um, um, uh, using um, a man and you worked against this lady um, it could be your mom that you dislike the person that your mom is with and you work against there's a lot of hate and jealousy that you're giving off to this lady and it's kind of weird though so you know but for the people who are looking for new love um, there is the end of a conflict that is coming in and news is going to be coming in there is the end of a conflict that is coming in and news is going to be coming in okay whatever the situation is okay um, but some of you are going to be happy because your wishes and dreams are coming true so you're going to be happy ladies and gentlemen I am wishing you a wonderful weekend I'm sorry I couldn't do online but I still do your freedom please like share these video and share 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 I'm gonna get your timestamp and I'm going to be uploading your videos um, as soon as possible because I'm so late but I had to do the monthlies so please enjoy your weekend and we will speak in the weekly readings we're going to be seeing what is coming in namaste